Gozi Maka. On Sensor Two, there are so many Persian American Canadians that want to see Iran bombed and lose. It is so confusing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've had conversations with them over the decades, right? They're low IQ. They're they're idiots, right? And the only reason, like for example, in every nation you can find traitors to that nation. Every nation, every culture, every peoples you will find traitors to those peoples, right? There were Jews helping the Nazis uh, commit genocide on Jews during World War II. There were Armenians helping the Turks commit genocide on Armenians during World War I. There are um, um, Arabs helping Israel commit genocide on Palestinians, right? In every throughout history you will find traitors to your nations right many of the iranians that um, because there's an iranian um, sect fanatics that were banished from iran they're cults they were puppets of israel and the united states and they were expelled from iran and many of them ended up in iraq they have a base in iraq right and some of them came out to the western world right um, it's the same thing that you saw when the uh, united states invaded iraq i had a conversation with the iranian um, when the united states invaded iraq we we're sitting on a table in a, in a bar right a local hangout and the guy turned to me and said oh the united states should do to iran what they've done to iraq man there was like eight of us on the table I ripped this guy a new asshole for 10 minutes. I fucking annihilated him, right? People are like, why is Chicho getting so pissed? Three years later, three years later, he came up to me. I hadn't seen him for a long time. Came up to me and said, hi, Chicho, how are you doing? I said, I know you. I go, you, you're, the, you're the guy that you wanted the United States to do to Iran what they did to Iraq and he goes no 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 I didn't say that I go you're that guy right he goes yeah I was wrong I'm sorry I go no motherfucker get the fuck away from you from me you're too uh, I, ain't, I ain't fucking associating with you it's not enough to say you're wrong right uh, you need to make amends right admitting it uh, admitting that you've done something on that level or supported something on that level it's not enough to say i'm sorry i was wrong it doesn't cut it you have to make amends so for example right now 90 percent of israelis support genocide on gaza support 100 percent genociding gazans genociding palestine right when this is all settled some of them will realize holy fuck we were committing genocide we're as bad as the nazis right they will they will okay trust me they will right but it's not enough for them to come on and say i'm sorry i we were mistaken not enough not enough no 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 and you can forgive them when they say i'm sorry if they sincerely mean it right but you can't let them off the hook if they commit genocide i don't yeah you better be sorry you piece of shit. but you gotta make amends right maybe for two decades every single one of them that supported genocide needs to go work in gaza building back people's homes right with their hands right maybe that's what it'll take maybe they'll have to commit to generations a couple of generations of their family rebuilding palestinian homes maybe that's what it'll take it's not enough to say sorry when you committed atrocities or supported atrocities it's not enough you have to make amends you have to make amends okay